Good evening. It is a distinct honor to be here tonight representing my brother, President Ferdinand R. Marcus Jr. on the celebration of the Cultural Center of the Philippines, 55th anniversary. Although he cannot join us in person, I'm privileged to deliver his message. Magandang gabi po sa inyong lahat. As we come together to celebrate the 55th anniversary of the Cultural Center of the Philippines and to confer Gawad CCP para sa Sini, I am reminded of the many unforgettable moments that have unfolded through its legacy. Proudly positioned along the stretch of Rojas Boulevard, and designed by the national luminary, architect Leandro Luxin. The CCP has been more than just a stage. In 1969, when the CCP was born, we were a country brimming with potential. The world was paying attention, and so were we, trying to figure out how to make our mark. And that is where the CCP came in a place where we could explore our identity as a nation and through art and culture, find our place in the world. And it is still 55 years later. The CCP stands as a living testament to that ambition, to capture the Filipino spirit in all its complexities. Yet being Filipino is no easy thing to define. Our culture is dynamic. We are consistently evolving, and the CCP has been a witness to that evolution. More than that, it has challenged us to go beyond what we know and stretch the limits of our imagination. Every performance, every artwork, every creative endeavor here is not just a reflection of who we are, but a glimpse of what we could be. Our art, our culture, is not just about nostalgia or history. It is about actively creating the future. It is about sharing a narrative that we can get to define, one that says, this is us, but also this is what we are capable of. Beyond art for art's sake, this institution has quietly fueled the creative economy that shapes the very fabric of our nation. What begins within these walls does not just stay here. It ripples outwards, inspiring industries, reshaping our identity, and reminding us that creativity is not just an expression. It is a force for change. Just last year, our creative industries contributed more than 1.7 trillion pesos to our economy. That's an undeniable testament to the power of creativity not just an expression of our culture, but as a driver of growth and opportunity for millions of Filipinos. And speaking of the future, you've noticed the ongoing renovations of the CCP. I know for many of us, this building holds a lot of memories, but this renovation is not just about sprucing up an iconic structure. It is about making sure it remains a home for Filipino creativity a place where future generations can ask the same questions we have been asking for more than five decades and maybe come up with new answers. To our Gawad CCP Para Sassining Awardees, tonight is also about you. Your contributions are more than just personal triumphs. They are a testament to the heights of Filipino creativity. Your work challenges us moves us and ultimately inspires us to think bigger, dream bolder, and see further. You've shown us that art does not just mirror life, it transforms it. As I think about what it takes to reach this level of artistry, I'm genuinely amazed by the journey each of you has traveled. Sure, the final piece is what gets the spotlight, but it is the story behind that that truly fights, fascinates me. It is the late nights, the relentless revisions, and the personal sacrifices that often go unnoticed. We see the finished product and are awed, but it's the hard work and dedication that truly deserve our recognition. 
This achievement represents the fulfillment of a dream that our creativity and talent are not just enough, but that our stories matter deeply and that we are capable of greatness, not only on the world stage, but right here at home. <clears throat> so what comes next? Well, that is the beauty of it. The future is ours to make, waiting for us to exceed expectations, test limits, and keep asking the tough questions. And the answers, they will not be found in standing still, but in the stories we have yet to write, the art we have yet to create, and the dreams we have yet to turn into reality. We define what comes next. Through our creativity, courage, and unrelenting pursuit of excellence, we carve out Ababu Pilipinas where the greatness of the Filipino spirit is not just imagined, but achieved. Ganyan tayo bilang mga Pilipino. We may stumble, we may question, but in the end we stand, we create, we move forward, sometimes against the odds, sometimes in ways no one expects. And always we do so with the belief that the best of what we are, of who we are, is still yet to come. To the Cultural Center of the Philippines, congratulations on this milestone. To our Gawad CCP Para Sa Sining awardees, thank you for reminding us that we are indeed a nation capable of great beauty, depth, and meaning. Maraming salamat po at mabuhay ang sining at kultura ng Pilipinas. <laughs>